saya I did it again It just feels like it's the right thing It feels like a A calling For me It doesn't make sense What doesn't make sense? I could In any way Be a calling for me If it involves such violence Frank, God calls us to do different things. You read? Yeah, yeah, I read. He calls on Abraham to kill his own son, Isaac, didn't he? But he didn't do it, it was just a test. Yes, it was. Perhaps. Perhaps this is the test for you, Frank. What? In what way? In a way that God is testing. How far you will go to preserve what is right. But without violence. Yeah. Hey, qu hey, qu close the door, mate. Come on. What? Close the door. What is it? Got a lot of shit in here. Yeah. That's true. But they won't listen. Even without violence, father, they... they're all stubborn. We're not supposed to be to resort to violence, are we? We're supposed to be the better person. Alright, so what you been up to lately? You know, just the uh, usual crack and snack distribution on the streets. Uh, no. How's that going? <laughs> pretty good. Pretty good, yeah. We're not doing it if they do on a day to day basis. We have tolerance. It's our strongest asset. And we must remember that love is more powerful and everlasting than anything else on this earth. Ooh, look at this, look at that. Oh boy, look at that. Oh boy, you was right. That's some good making right there. Hell yeah. What you plan on doing with it? Uh, I don't know. What can you really do these days, Terrence? Uh, honestly, I don't even know. I mean, uh, what can you buy these days? Drugs? More drugs? So, well, there's love on this earth. There's so much hate. But up there, when you make it to that glorious heaven, you will only see love, Frank. I, I could buy a house, maybe. But, yeah, I'm, I'm fine with where I live now. And I never really like change. Yeah. I've been, I've been around these streets all my life, you know, and they know my name and I know all theirs. So. You're talking kind of funny. That's the beauty of it. It does pay off in the end. We just have to go through all of our trials here and outlast the ones who don't us. Are you one of them fellas who, who smokes their own crack? One word, I'm professional. I didn't even do that. Back in the day when I was some of those street boys. <laughs> street boys? Yeah. I wasn't going to get up, give up no opportunity to sell the new buyers. The ones in uh, middle school and high school are the ones that buy the most dope anyway. Think about it this way. If there wasn't darkness, well then we wouldn't be able to see the light. Want to know why that is? Why? Because <laughs> they want to experiment, try new things. It's all in their head, you know. One, their friends are telling them about the drugs and the whole peer pressure thing. And uh, two, they're going through all these hormonal imbalances, you know? Goodness always pays off with the one who keep the goodness alive. Even if everything else seems covered in darkness. I, I guess when you, when you put it that way, it makes sense, you yeah. know? Makes a whole lot of sense. See, I got some knowledge up here. My, my mama told me I never amounted nothing. And uh, look where I am now. <laughs> Thank you, Father. Well said. Very well said. See ya. You know, I never asked you if you wanted a drink. Nah, fine, man. I'm good. So yourself? Anyways, I was, uh, I noticed that bat you had there. For your penance, do ten Hail Marys and five Our Fathers. I absolve your sins. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Hell, amen. Why do you have it? Uh, you know, just a uh, safety precaution. You know how these streets are. It's dangerous out there. It's tough. Yeah, that's all it is. You're yeah. right. <clears throat> so why don't you go ahead and tell me the truth? I'm telling you, man, these streets is dangerous. Oh, you know, all day is. Yeah. I'll tell you what. <laughs> what? Tell me. Tell you something that'll change your mind. Yeah. I got a fortify under this table right now, and I got a whole lot of truth under this table right with me. 
Terrence, what are you talking about? I'll tell you what the hell I'm talking about. I'm talking about you walking up in here with that baseball bat, ready to bash my goddamn head in, all over my goddamn white carpet. And I'll tell you something. How about a 45 bullet in your head, with your blood and brain staining my carpet? The law here, you know. Gunshots ring pretty loud out here. People will be coming, cops will be... Now you're just making shit up. Gunshots ring out here all the time. No one's been arrested yet. You're making a very stupid mistake. You're the one who made the mistake, my friend. You even know why I came in here with my goddamn baseball bat ready to bash your head in? I have a theory. Which is? You're an undercover cop. <laughs> he thinks I'm a cop. I ain't no undercover nobody. Shit, you ain't. Uh, Alright, fine. See it your way. I shouldn't be the one who's worried, though. I don't see why not. You don't. You, that's good. That's real good, because I got a few theories of my own. Might as well let you spell them out before you die. Thank you. First off, would a cop really use a bat to take out one of his victims? Why, why wouldn't he just cuff him? I bet you got some cuffs up in there. May I stand, please, so I can show you? Stand up. Can stand I can up. show you that I don't need cuffs? I mean, yeah. just seriously, look. Stand up. I'm looking at you. Stand up. Let me just stand up. Sorry. Hey, are you okay? Don't, don't beat me again. I'm not going to beat you. Do it. Nothing. Nothing. You, you believe me now? I don't know what to... Sit your ass down. I still think you. Sit. 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 Thank you. You really want to kill me, your best friend, or some mild suspicion? You, you've been you're smoking the, some of that meth you got left? I, I, you've been like, I, real paranoid lately. I hear you about my, my listening. So you know who they were? Just, just a bunch of wackos. Didn't see the damn faces, though. So. It's a shame. If I did, I'd not report them. Ain't the best if you uh, walking out of here and uh, leave the baseball bat. We can forget all this. It's the best I can give you right now, because uh, my head's really messed with me. This is my, I can't leave the bat. This is my dad's bat. I can't leave. I'm not going to do that. I wish I knew, too. It won't bother me anymore, though. All I wanted was some money. All anybody wants these days. And besides, I told you I needed it for, for protection. I guess I'm going to have to shoot you. For, for what reason? I already told you. Where'd you grow up? Just a uh, normal middle class home. We weren't rich, but you know, we weren't struggling much either. Here, look. Don't. Just don't relax. Get my wallet. Don't shoot. I understand. I had, I had that too. Then I moved out on my own. Turned 18. <laughs> the real world. That's what my parents called it. Yeah. What the hell is all this? Just count. Why? I saw my brother get shot down for goddamn plasma screen TV. We tried lifting Rob off the, off the pavement, but... You don't believe me, just count it. No cop can produce this. It's genuine. Cops can produce millions of dollars. I've seen it myself. Get this bureaucratic money off my goddamn table. That's just, that's just how the city is. Uh, I know. After I left home, I realized that real world can catch up with you pretty quick out of high school. This is my money. I earned it. I told you, you can walk around here and leave that baseball bat. We can forget all that. Grew up in apartments for about a year or two. Pay my rent, you know. But later I decided I'd try it their way, you know. Just, so, I, so I went out and I grew up on the streets to see if I could. I just don't think I can keep up anymore. Keep up with what? I just don't think I can keep up with people like that anymore. People like what? Who? I mean, I wish I could stop all of them, you know, like the dealers, the rapists, and all the sick bastards out there. In the ideal world, get them all off the streets, and then, then maybe it wouldn't be so bad. Now, Frank, you say you ain't no undercover cop, and if that's your money, that there is your money, then why don't you just do what I tell you? No. No, this is my dad's bat. This went through a lot of generations, and now it's here. I'm not going to leave it. I tell you something, sir. You're a nice guy and all. Give me this money. Get them all off the streets. Well, if it were possible, I tell you something. It wouldn't change a goddamn thing. Yeah, why is that? You look around and tell me. No, no. Go ahead. This world isn't so bad. Now you're putting me in a tough situation, Frank. You're putting me in a very tough situation. I, I don't want to shoot you. 
So why don't you just walk up on out of here? Yeah, I already know you're not going to shoot me. Well, I shot my own goddamn grandfather because he wouldn't stop bothering me about my drug addiction. So it makes you think I won't hesitate to kill you too. I seen, I seen shit you ain't never seen. That you ain't never want to see. It's because you come from a different lifestyle. Try living down here, begging for people for money all day. Shit. They all think I want it for drugs. <laughs> Funny thing is I do. I wish it wasn't like this. I know what, yeah, I know what you've done. Don't remind me, you pedophile. What the hell are you talking about? Now I'm going to have to shoot you for calling me that. Why don't I say a few words as the old saying goes before I bleed out and die? Well, you'll be, you'll be dead before you hit the ground, but uh, go ahead. The brain still functions. You don't just, you, you don't just die when you get shot in the head. It, it takes time. Is that what you're going to tell me? No. I want to tell you is how sick an individual you are. If that's true, then why not get help and go to a rehab center? <laughs> nah. Why not? Money. That's what it's all about. Yes, a uh, sex offender, a rapist, uh, and we both know a drug dealer who doesn't hesitate to kill anyone, even his own family members. Good to know. Anything else you want to enlighten me on before I torture you? Your mother was a Christian, am I not correct? Now don't talk about my mom that way. I'm just making sure, no time here, no time here. I'm just, um, I want to make sure that the next thing I see is not Then they expect you to be perfectly clean afterwards. It still work that way, man. Well, I tell you, sir, I could. Who's this? What are you gonna tell me? That I'm a sinner and I'm gonna go to hell? Um, yeah, see, yeah, I was gonna, yeah, but I was also gonna list the reasons why, because it seems, it occurs to me that you don't know why, we, you, you know, I, why else would you be such a selfish prick? I don't know. I was thinking of more ways to torture you. Snuff, wacko. Thinking you right all this wrong. Tell you one thing is, he may be stopping some druggies. He ain't never taking down an operation though. So he's just wasting his time. Funny thing is, cops think he's a drug dealer himself. See that right there? That's one reason. And also, thou shalt not kill. Thou shalt not lie, cheat, adultery, uh, covet the neighbor's goods, wife. That's six. That's six right there. Six, right? six, six. So what? It's a lot of money. <laughs> a lot of money? That's true. Well, usually my rule is ten. Ten for what? Ten commandments. Uh, so my rule usually is you break, you break ten, I kill you myself. But the thing is, I, I've never really met anyone who's broken ten commandments, and I'm sure they're out there. I know they're out somewhere. And since uh, uh, technically, if if I killed you, that would be contradicting myself. So I'd have to break one of my own bones. People don't, they don't see the logic behind it. See, this guy's smart. He ain't wearing the thing for enjoyment. I bet he's... I bet he hates to wear the thing when he's beating people. What, what the hell are you talking about? You, you, you sound goddamn insane right now. I just figured a new rule. If he went out by himself without that mask on, he'd be in prison already. However many commandments you break here on earth, is how many bones I break in you. <laughs> you think it's funny? <laughs> Where's this guy been the whole goddamn time? <laughs> it looks like what you got, you got what you needed, so... You're heading out there. But, sir, thank you. Just, just let me ask you something, sir. Yeah, what? Why'd you give me the money? This guy. This guy's been here the whole time. He just didn't know. Why didn't you give it to someone else? I don't know. Aren't you awake? Oh, my head, man. You know, uh, oh. your, your dirty cops came by, oh. and I had to pay him off with half my money. Oh. And I'm going to have to spend the other half uh, in a hospital because you shot me in the... Yeah, it hurt pretty bad. So, yeah. That's, uh... Yeah, I know it hurts. What are you doing, man? 
You know, I know it hurts a lot. Headshots usually do because there's all the yeah. bone fragmentations and the, the blood. <laughs> you lost your goddamn... The, the swelling. You lost your... Yeah. Um, you lost your mind. I hope I didn't give you brain damage. You understand <laughs> what I'm saying? Ugh. Uh, that's not good. Alright, Terrence, look, I have to stay true to my word. I, I have to, otherwise that would make me a liar and I can't do that, otherwise I'd have to bash my own head in. So... Yeah, do you understand now what you did was wrong? Uh, can you even hear me? I hope I didn't hit you that hard. Either way, you? Uh, that's one, so now you're down to five. How about two for the ease? Oh. Alright, uh, that one didn't really quite uh, come out. Please, that one again. don't. Don't! Uh, uh, uh. Oh, <laughs> can't throw it. Can't throw right, my knee. Stop me, man, and I'll stop. Uh. I'll stop. <laughs> All right, look. Uh. Stop. Okay, I'll give you a break. I'll give you a break. I'm like a wall. I just want to know what, if you can tell me what you did was wrong. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm done lying. If I'm dead right here. I did those things. I did it all while everyone else said it was wrong. I, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed every bit of it. Give me pleasure. Goddamn, what's wrong with that? Why does anyone care what I do with my business? <coughs> if God really wanted us to do these things, he would have struck me down, wouldn't he? Like he did in Moses' day. Don't you talk about God like that. That was before. It's before the commandments were created. Before he started this world anew. Those commandments were created to replace so that he wouldn't have to strike people down anymore. Because it was intended that the people would follow his commandments accordingly. So what are you doing then? Playing God? Trying to step in for him? You're just one man. So there might be one rapist in here, but there's a thousand million more out there. So what was that, three? So you got three more. Please. Oh! 